welcome back to another video so as you can see i already got my makeup done so it's not a tutorial but today i will be doing a it would it would it was gonna be an unboxing but i already unboxed it so so i'm gonna be doing a review on the fuji film insta x hello kitty polaroid camera this is what the box looks like i really love it and here's the side and here's the bag where it shows like all the stuff that came with it the camera the um pack of film the um necklace part <laughs> and some stickers so i'm gonna be showing you guys this this retails for like a hundred something i'll put the price yeah. on the screen i don't know exactly it was a gift but this camera is amazing it is perfect like i don't know how to explain it other than that but like if you really like hello kitty this you, you should put this on your wish list for someone to get you unless you're gonna buy it for yourself but i love it so this is how the front of the camera looks as you can see it's like a baby pink it has the pink bow right here it says hello kitty Here's the lens, and right here is the mirror in the camera. So while you're um, taking a picture, you can look at yourself in the mirror so you can see how the picture is going to turn out. This is the button to take the picture. Obviously, this is the flash. And this is where you um, look through if you were to take the picture of someone else. And here's the back of the camera. So it just has like this part where you put your thumb. Right here, it says zero because there's zero films in there. And here's where you insert the film. So I'll be showing you guys how to insert the film right now. This is a pack of InstaX um, macaron film, you know, the ones that change colors. It's very easy how to do this, like anybody can do it. You can do it if you put your back into it. So just open up the box. A film i'm not sure if this is you guys first time doing this but i watched one video and it was easy and it comes protected of course so you really don't want it comes with directions on the film as well just you just tear it open and put it into your camera i'm gonna tear it open it has like ugh, it has like a dotted line for you to tear it off it has this right here so you can tear it and open it And it has the yellow right here. And on the inside, you see this already had a piece of film in there. So I just take it out. It's empty. And here's the yellow. You just match up the yellow. So yellow right here. Yellow right there. Put this in and close it. Boom. And this is how you turn the camera on. Right here, you just press this button and the lens will pop out. And you can hear it starting up. So it has different modes. It has right here. So it starts inside. And we're inside the house. So it just knows. It can sense the light. How much light there is. If it was cloudy. Sunny. Very sunny. And here's a high key option you can switch to. So if you want to change it. You just twist this outer white part. That has the um. 60 millimeter focus lens right here you just twist this as you can see it has this indent and it's twisting to the different um settings so since we're inside i'm going to be using the house inside setting after we place the film inside of it it has the s which shows that the film is in, a new pack of film is inside and you have to take a starter picture before you can start taking actual pictures with the film. So this is a starter picture. I'll just um take a picture right here. Cause this is how this is how it opens the film. So I just took a picture. But the only thing that's gonna come out is a black piece from the film box. This is the back of the film box right here. See right here is missing the back. This is the back piece back here. And after we did that, 
Now, it said it has 10 pieces of film left to take. So I'm gonna take a picture right now. As you can see, I'm looking at myself in the mirror because obviously I wanna see how the picture's gonna turn out and look. I'm trying to figure out what should I do. Now the picture is coming out. Boom, this is how it looks. And I'm just gonna sit this right here and let it develop. And let's time it. So all right, I've been recording. It's it's 10:36 and let's time it. So this camera, I'm gonna close the lens. I'm gonna turn it off. To turn it off, all you do is push the lens back in, and it's off. So if you press the button, you see I'm pressing the button. It's not going to take a picture because it's off. So like I said, in the box, it came with stickers. Here's the manual. Um, I don't really need the manual. It's just telling you how to work it. But it comes with this manual. This is what it looks like. It comes in different languages as well. English, Dutch, French, Spanish. Um, Korean and Chinese. So this is the strap for the camera. I'm... I'm still trying to figure out how to um put this on my camera. It's a small piece. I think I lost for it. Like this piece right here has this black piece, but I lost the other piece of this one. So I'm not really sure how to put it on the camera. This is how it looks. It's like a very cute plaid um pink and yellow combo. I think it goes well with this. Yeah, I think that's cute. My boyfriend also bought me a case for it, but it's with him. It's not with me, so. The stickers were so cute. I put one on my laptop, actually. I'll show you guys. Put one on my laptop right here. Look how cute is Hello Kitty taking a picture with the Hello Kitty camera. That is so cute. It came with this magnifier thing. I'm not really sure how to describe it. Um, I never obviously opened it, so I'm gonna open it right now. Let's just check in. So this is what the picture looks like. I like it. It's very nice. It's a good picture. It definitely lightens. It's very light. Um, I'm, the flash is very bright. That's what it is. The flash is very bright. You see how big this is? This flash is very bright. So to put on the close-up lens... This is for when you're taking selfies. I didn't even know this. You just place it over top of the lens. On the lens, it has like this insert on this side, right by the mirror, and the insert on the other side. So you just place it like this over top of it and just pop it in there. And just pop it in. You heard it pop? So now... That's when you're taking selfies and close-up pictures. So I'm gonna take another selfie and see if it cha if it changes. All right. As you can see, it's printing it out. I'm gonna let this develop as well. And it doesn't take that long to develop. It takes like two or three minutes, which is a, I think is a good amount of time. And to take off the close-up lens, you just pop it off. It's like this part right here. Just pop it off, boom. Your camera's still fine. I really, really like this camera. I really recommend it. I think it's I think it's definitely worth it because it's not just the camera you're paying for and the brand of the camera, you're paying for the brand of Hello Kitty. Like it's obviously it has the San Rio trademark, like this isn't fake, this is real, like yeah. So if you don't want the boring like Insta X like the insects like they cool looking but they like everybody got one like uh this is different like this is like yeah even though it's, it's like more bulky i feel like it's still worth it like this just adds to it it's so pretty so cute it's definitely worth the money so i recommend if you want to get this if you've been having think if you've been thinking about it having second thoughts i recommend you buy it and if you don't like it, I feel like you can still return it because it's just a camera. Like, So the photo is still developing, but this is how it's looking so far. 
it's kind of a difference between these two. As you can see, the color started going back into my face from this one as it developed more. This one is, as it's developing, is looking more cool toned. That's what I realized. It's very cool toned. And it's bringing out, so the background is very cool and it's bringing out the warmth in my face. Same as this one. Um, with this pack of film, it's, every, it's a different color every time. So it's like a fade. So it would be like right here. So it went from peach, orangey peach to peachy green. If you guys have any questions about it, leave comment them down below and I will answer them. Also, if you guys want to check out any of my makeup tutorials, because obviously I, I beat my face, like, I did a um, TikTok on this eyeshadow look, so if you want to see that, I'll put my information down below. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below for more. Just like it. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye.